What's up, you freaking geniuses? So in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to find the axis of symmetry and vertex of a graph in standard form, All right? So this problem right here says, find the axis of symmetry and vertex of the graph f of x is equal to 2x squared plus 8x minus one. Okay, and just to remind you, the standard form of a parabola is f of x is equal to ax squared plus bx plus c, okay? So you can see we have all our coefficients right here, right? So then in this problem right here, two uh, is a, eight is b, and then negative one is c, right? Okay, so the first thing you need to do is find the axis of symmetry. Now to find the axis of symmetry, you need to know this little equation right here. So it's x is equal to negative b over two a. Okay, so this little formula right here tells you where the x coordinate or the x value is for the axis of symmetry. Okay, so then here, this is gonna be equal to uh, negative. So on top we have b. So remember b in this example is eight, right? Positive eight, and that's over two a, and a is positive two. Okay, so then this is gonna be equal to negative eight over four, and eight over four is equal to two, right? So then this is equal to negative two, all right? So the axis of symmetry is at x is equal to negative two. All right, I'll write it right here. X is equal to negative two. Okay, cool. So we found our axis of symmetry. Okay, so now we need to find the vertex. Now what you need to remember about the vertex is that the axis of symmetry runs straight through the vertex, right? Now we don't know where the vertex is, but we do know now where the x coordinate of the vertex is. So the vertex is at negative two comma something, okay? Because we just found what the x coordinate is, right? It's at negative two. So how do you find the, the y value, the something? Well, all you need to do is plug in the, the x value that we know, negative two, into this formula right here for x, right? For x right there, okay? So to find the vertex, we're gonna say that f of x is equal to uh, 2x squared plus 8x minus 1, okay? But we know what our x is, right? It's negative 2. So we're going to plug in a negative 2 there and a negative 2 there. So then this is going to be equal to 2 times negative 2 squared plus 8 times negative 2 minus 1. So then uh, let's simplify this. So this is going to be equal to, well, first of all, negative 2 squared, right? PEMDAS, do your exponents first. Negative two squared is positive four, and then positive four times two is eight. And then we're gonna add that to eight times negative two, which is negative 16, and then negative one, right? So then here we have eight minus 16, which is negative eight, and then negative eight minus one is equal to negative nine, right? So that means our y value right here, when x is negative two, our y value is negative nine, right? So then your vertex is at negative two comma negative nine. So if you found the video helpful, definitely leave a thumbs up down below. And if you have any other questions or want to see any other examples, just let me know in the comment section below.